it is August 1st, 2024 at 6.25am. I woke up and I had a bit of a wet patch in my underwear. Um, and I'm not sure if that's the beginning of labour or not, so I just thought I'd begin documenting the process and what's going on today. I've got a midwife appointment at 8am, so I'm just getting ready to leave for that. And we'll see what the midwife says. Also forgot to mention that I will be getting a stretch and sweep while I'm at the midwife, so if it's needed, after all, we'll see. Yeah, keep you posted. We're going to check out waters. Yay. We're at the hospital. Checking out waters. Your How waters. exciting. <laughs> Our waters, we made them together. Contractions or whatever they call them. They could be having contractions. I don't know yet. I don't because I can't feel them, so that's good. <laughs> but that's his heartbeat. Should I zoom in? That bottom number jumped to 20. It was at 14, now it's at 26. It didn't even feel the same. Is it because I laughed? Could be. He might. He might just be. Ready to walk out. Mm -hmm. So, I'm chilling here for another five minutes and then she'll be coming to check if there is water. Exciting. See you soon, little man. Oh my gosh, it's almost 12. Wow, what time did we get here? Like, 10? I'm not sure, darling, I can't remember. I can't remember what time we got here, but it's almost 12 o'clock now. We have been released. Um, no baby. <laughs> no broken waters. No broken waters. Mucus plug is still there. Ew. <laughs> um... But it looks like I am having slight contractions. So they're very mild at this point. Uh, so for the rest of the day, we're just going to go chill. Going to try the mile circuit. That was. Clean the house. Clean the house. Get a cheeseburger and a milkshake. Got to go to Ikea. I'm going to go to Ikea. So I'm many things to, to do. And then when we get home, we'll do the mile circuit that was highly recommended by a fair few midwives that we spoke to so we'll try that and see how we go hopefully everything's progressing by today so I don't have to go in for an induction on Tuesday hopefully he's here later tonight yeah <laughs> wouldn't that be good wouldn't that be good so good very exciting mum and dad <laughs> <laughs> Can't even see you. <laughs> it's so bright. What's well, the time? 4.26. And I started getting some more contractions that were more painful at like 1 o'clock. Um, they're pretty frequent now. Um, yeah, about 2 every 10 minutes. But chilling, waiting to see what happens sooner or later I suppose. Yeah, we have to make our way to the hospital hopefully soon. Yeah, and it's 
the 2nd of August. Hopefully, Second. happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> Good Bee's birthday today. Yeah, how cute. <laughs> That's a cute birthday, 2nd of August. Yeah, 2nd of August is a cute birthday. Just not the 3rd, I don't mind. <laughs> Have another one. And that's that. How long that last one? Like 40, between, so it was 50. Then. So they're pretty frequent. Okay, yeah, yeah. Do you want to go to the hospital? <laughs> I don't know. You don't want to have the baby in the car on the way to the hospital. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe let's wait 15 more minutes. Okay. Maybe I'll make a sandwich. Oh. <laughs> You're the wind in my sails, you're the pull of the sea, you're the wish in the well, you're my faithful belief. If the whole wide world was offered to me, I still did it. Be all I did it. I she did it. In six hours. Seven hours. Seven hours. Seven of what? Seven, sorry. No, from labouring to pushing, then he came out six or seven hours. Hallelujah. I had a birth in the pool and I did most of my labouring on the ground on a mattress or leaning over the bed and then I was able to get in the bath, which was the goal. And I did, but then I ended up birthing him out on the stairs because he had a bit of meconium and he's flipping us off already. Oh. 